Hey Chance, what's happening? Welcome to another episode of Tag Along with Chai. We are at Tham Luang Kunam Nanong Cave in the northern part of the northern province of Chiang Rai because of a very special story that involved a lot of children getting stuck in a cave a few hundred meters away from here. Before I start this episode, I'd like to pay my respect to the two people that passed away because they were involved in the rescue operation a few years ago. Saman Kunam. He passed away on the 6th of July after delivering the oxygen bottles and Beirut Bakbara who passed away the following year due to a blood infection. It's a national park and they made it impossible for us to carry on driving through this road to go to the actual cave. We are on the farmer property at the moment only literally a few hundred meters away from the cave but the cave is located in a national park and this whole national park is closed for maintenance. The 30th of September they will give an update when they're finishing this. They might be finishing on the 30th of September already but if you're trying to drive up there to go to the actual cave this is not possible at the moment. On the 23rd of June in 2018 a football team of 12 children and its coach decided to go for a birthday celebration for one of the team members to go to this cave. After the kids were already two and a half kilometers inside the cave, one of the kids found out that the water was rising in one of the chambers of the cave. And it was at some stage not possible anymore to return back to the entrance of the cave. They went to this cave because one of the boys was celebrating its birthday. And the parents, they already had a SpongeBob cake. They had many presents for this cat waiting for him to get home, but the kid obviously didn't come back. Soon enough, they found out where they went. So they knew that they had to go to this national park. Once arriving at the cave, they found a lot of bicycles. They understood that the kids and their coach were in trouble, stuck in the cave. This was big news all over the world. We heard of this, you probably know about the story already. Also, they made even a film on Netflix out of this. The Thai Cave Rescue is called. It's not even out yet while making this video. Thousands of people all over the world were helping and there are some professional divers that can dive in extreme conditions. Because of the monsoon rain, a lot of water was flowing down the caves, different types of streams. There were really hard conditions to search for the children. The moment they started the rescue operation, they were hoping that the children and the coach were still alive. Two British divers finally, after more than a week, found the 12 kids and the coach alive on an elevated rock in one of the chambers in the cave. Such a good surprise. The only problem was there to get them out of there. So what they did was first feeding them, making sure they had enough oxygen because they were really weak. You can imagine they haven't had a lot of food for more than a week. They were fortunate that they had birthday snacks with them and also the coach, such a heroic move of him to say no to the birthday snacks. He wanted the kids to have them. He was only 25 years old back then. The children were still alive. The coach was still okay. This was the first step of the rescue operation. They knew they were okay. They maybe gonna make it. After a few days of giving the right amount of food, water, oxygen, the rescue team decided to start the next step of the rescue operation. From the 6th of July 2018 till the 10th of July 2018, the children were rescued one by one. We could celebrate this and obviously everyone was so happy. It could be such a happy episode, but two of the rescue workers have passed away due to this event. So yeah, unfortunately it is a tragic story still. I think it's amazing that the people got stuck here for such a long time. Unfortunately, I couldn't find someone on time right now to interview for this video. Normally this channel has a lot of interviews we're meeting a lot of people along the way this is not happening in this episode that's why i'm just telling you the story right here we are in a cave right now just a small little one overhanging rock um, and it's raining there are some thunderstorms as well so yeah kind of brings us as well a little bit closer to that period of time where this all was happening netflix will release thai cave rescue on the 22nd of september we traveled to chiang rai for this episode to show you this spot we knew the cave was already shut or the national park was shut but uh, we wanted to come as close as possible bring you as well 
as close as possible. Not too long ago, I introduced the champ of the day. I would like to give the champ of the day to all of the people that were involved in the rescue operation. That is going to the police officers, the divers, the people, the family, the people from the village, the people all over the world, basically, whoever got involved in this rescue operation and made this rescue operation happened. We're based in the north of Thailand, showing you the beauty of Southeast Asia. We're also doing some storytelling, as you see, interviews along the way, We're meeting a lot of interesting people. It definitely helps us to give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed this episode. Also, sharing this video on your own social media does definitely help. I would like to say from Chiang Rai at Tam Luang Cave in the north of Thailand, bye for now and stay champ. <laughs>